Hi, this is Karen Law with Maya Road. Today I'm back to show you how to make this beautiful necklace using some Maya Road embellishments. You only need about 10 minutes to complete this project that you can use for yourself or as a gift. So let's get started. So to get started, we're going to gather all our supplies. You'll need a hot glue gun and some glue sticks. You'll need one of our antique scallop edge flowers. I'm going to be using one of our mocha colored ones for contrast here to make it easier to see. You'll need our beaded uh, centers. You'll need two of our large alterable trinkets. These are going to be the little leaves on your necklace. You're going to need about 34 inches of 6 millimeter beaded chain. My road does sell this by the yard. You're going to also need um, one little felt, about one inch circle. You can just cut that out any old felt. And you'll also need a pair of pliers. So for our necklace here that you see, it's actually a 30 inch long necklace. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your beaded chain and you're going to use your pliers to open the loop. And after you do that, you're going to make your necklace by looping it through another one of the circles and then you're going to close it with your pliers. So you have a necklace like this. And here's your completed chain right here. So you're going to set that aside and what you're going to do is you're going to complete the flower. To do that you're going to take your flower out of the package and find where you think the center is and then take one of your beaded centers and you're going to just add some hot glue here and you're going to glue it right to the center of your flower. Again I'm using one of our mocha colored ones for contrast. Give it about a good 20 seconds because you want the bead to hold. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take my chain and what we do is we're going to set that flower right in the center here and we're going to glue it down. And I'll show you from the original sample what it looks like. This is what the back of the flower looks like. So you're just going to flip that around. You're going to add a little bit of hot glue right in the middle. And then you're going to lay your chain kind of where the bottom part, the V part, starts. You're going to lay your chain right in the middle there. Again, you're going to give it about 20 seconds for it to hold. Next, you're going to add these ultra trinkets as leaves. And you can see what I did is I just added them here. Again, what you'll want to do is give it a little bit of hot glue and put a leaf on. And then you put a little bit more hot glue here. And you're going to do it again. And you can see the back of the two necklaces look the same. Now if you want to have a nice finish to your necklace, what you're going to do is you're going to take your felt circle that you cut out, and you're going to add some hot glue, and you're going to put it right in the middle, and that will cover up all the adhesive that you have showing with the chain. Again, give it about 20 seconds to hold, and there you are. There's your completed necklace. These necklaces make beautiful presents or you can make a couple for yourself. We also have kits that um, allow you to make two of these in one kit that uh, retail at your local scrapbook store or online store. You can buy them at MayaRoad.com. Thanks for joining me today.